Hey everyone, it's Ashley and I'm back with a quick and easy meal idea. This is supposed to be a kind of a bargain um, type of meal prep and this is something that you can throw together pretty quickly if you're having a long day and you just want to make something um, very quickly. So I'm going to show you how to make um, angel hair pasta with some yellow squash and some fancy snow peas. So I think this one will be a really fun one uh, for you guys to work with. It's a super simple recipe. All you're going to need is some yellow squash and currently this is in season so um, you can find the uh, regular one for about a dollar sixty um, a pound or you can find the organic for right under a dollar ninety nine a pound and I picked up um, several pounds of that and then you're gonna need a box of angel hair pasta and in here I have some uh, frozen onions or you can use a fresh onion um, you'll need some type of oil some seasonings particularly parsley pepper salt um, the snow peas as well and I just picked up a frozen one that's under a dollar as well and you can just experiment with the spices and the oil and stuff that you have in your house but I'm just going to show you guys how to make it the first step is to actually prep uh, your squash you're going to want to make sure you wash it thoroughly and then you're going to actually use a sharp knife and cut it into slices so I'll show you that part So you're going to want to go ahead and cut these into slices. I cut them um, varying right around the half inch to quarter inch size. Just depends how thick you like your slices, but it's easier to cook if you keep them on the thinner side. And what I'm going to go ahead and do is actually add them to my pan here. Um, first I'm going to take some vegetable oil and I'm actually going to heat up some vegetable oil, um, at least a few tablespoons, and then I'm going to take some of my um, frozen onions here and I'm going to actually saute these so they'll actually have a really nice flavor and then I will add the slices in. So I currently have the onions over um, medium heat currently and I'm going to go ahead and keep stirring them. I want them to get a little bit um, starting towards where they're getting brown so I get that nice flavor coming out and then I'll go ahead and add um, the other pieces. I did actually have to increase my oil a little bit because um, this is a large pan and I am going to end up frying quite a few of these, so uh, that's just one thing to keep in mind. So you want to cook the squash over a medium-high heat. You can add a little bit of extra oil and just make sure to cook it about 12 to 14 minutes. If you're at a higher elevation, you're going to have to add a little bit extra time, which I am, so I have to add more time. And when it gets done about halfway, then you're going to want to start cooking your pasta and your snow peas. So while the squash is frying in the pan, I have another container of water and I'm going to make that boil so that it'll be ready to cook the angel hair pasta, which should be, I think, 7 to 10 minutes the peas on and all I did was put them in a pot and I put some water in the bottom of the pot here. I'm going to cover it up and put it on low and just let them simmer and that way it kind of steams them and gets them um, nice and cooked. started the pasta and the directions say to let it cook for approximately four to five minutes. If you're higher altitude you're definitely going to have to increase the time. For us it's probably closer to seven to ten minutes.
And here's the finished result. I hope you guys enjoyed this really quick, um, easy meal. And there's a whole bunch of different ways that you can actually make this and alter it so that you can make it um, to your specific taste. You can always add cream in with the noodles and make it kind of a creamy sauce. Or you can, instead of pan frying, you can actually throw the um, squash in the oven as well. And that's just another option. But um, it looks like it turned out good. So if you enjoyed this type of video, please like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys later. Bye.